always posted a crazy ass video like i don't know where he gets these ideas from but we're watching this stop this trend and win a lambo i mean you damn near tell me to, to stop a damn a bus a hyena a pack of wolves i'm doing it for a damn lambo especially a yuris boy quarter million lambo how do you stop that bitch though Thank you. And on top of Can you drive off? I'm also going to have these eight soldiers shoot 10,000 bullets at your Lamborghini. That's the scariest thing I've ever seen. Wait, yeah. what? It's going to be fun. And you have exactly 24 hours to build whatever you want to protect your Lamborghini from the bullets. The timer starts now. Oh, okay, what the hell? Defense, I'm thinking a wall of cinder blocks. After that, some shipping containers filled with refrigerators. And then basically just a wall of cars to block those bullets. Do you think all of this is enough to stop 10,000 bullets? I think it is, Jimmy. Okay, but so far nothing's there. You should get to building. Blake immediately drove to three stores where I Bro, Mr. Beast is crazy, bro. What in the hell is this video, bro? No, I'm not putting in that work, man. I'm trying to be um I'm trying to live I'm trying to live off that motherfucking ball. Hey, make your dreams come true, bro. I mean, I believe in you. Simple as that. You you what like you a teenager yet or something, bro? Yeah, hey, you can do anything that you put your mind to, bro. Your mind is a powerful ass thing. If you tell you your mind, you can be a professional athlete. You can be a professional athlete. If you want to be a doctor, a lawyer, anything. If you put your mind to it, you got it. Promise you. Just keep working. Just keep working. You just can't think. You gotta work though. His first round of supplies are starting to show up. Oh my god, I can't believe I bought all this stuff and this isn't even everything, man. He's got a water truck. Some of his junk cars came in. He's got a Connex crate over here. How did he eat this much stuff? This is crazy. Don't worry about the guys with the machine guns. Just pretend they're not there. Yeah. I don't even know what they're doing there, honestly. We're five hours in, and this storage container is about to be the first line of defense against 10,000 bullets. All right, that's probably good. That's probably good. Do you think that shipping container is going to stop any bullets? Absolutely not. So as of now, he's screwed. Yeah, he's not looking good for him. Oh, gosh. It's been about six hours. Are you happy with your progress? I'm very happy. You sure? Wasn't until this dude, Mr. Beast, bought a Lambo to shoot it up, bro. If this would stop the bullets? And they said no. This and dude is crazy, bro. He had to go all out. He worked Weapon only. with my basketball. I had to retire. You're 16. I had to retire, bro. Really nice, really nice. Really nice. I played in college, and I'm all done. You know what I mean? I wasn't good enough to be a pro. Put together, I was honestly pretty impressed. Maybe overseas, but I didn't really want to. In the front, I mean, the tallest part of the wall is right in the center to block the crow's nest machine guns because those things are big and scary. I got all my storage containers and a bunch of water. And if you come right over here, you will see his Lamborghini tucked away amongst everything. There it is, nice and cozy. Do you think all of this will stop the bullets? Yeah, I do. I think you have a 50% chance of survival. The best odds I've had is this video gonna get copyrighted? Come with me to the Lamborghini. Not only are you competing for this Lamborghini, but for a hundred grand as well. What? What the there, fuck? Yeah, that's pretty cool. Huh? This I had once. <laughs> Twenty-four hours is up. Eight scary men. Ten thousand bullets versus everything. Them niggas locked and loaded. They got the AKs, the machine guns. What the hell? Ten thousand bullets. They're ripping through that shit. Oh my god. Oh god. Yo, walls are crumbling. They did they just unload him. And what we haven't told Blake, oh hell. Those are only the first of four phases we've designed to destroy this Lamborghini. Or should I say whatever remains after this? So the Lamborghini is not surviving. So you just bought that car to destroy it. You have to go to sleep. The stupid test didn't learn much shit. I feel you, bro. This tough players ever see is better than half the bench warmers in the NBA. And you might be right about that. But hey, get your sleep, bro. I appreciate you for dropping by, bro. It's been a long time, bro. Hey, I appreciate you, bro. No cap. No cap, bro. It's all love. These niggas is tearing this shit up, though. Oh, God, please be safe. Please be safe. How is it? 
it. She's clean, baby. Oh. There's no bullet holes in your Lamborghini. And if That's you crazy. Know who Blake is, he's actually a contestant from two previous videos. But today he's back for a third and final attempt to win the grand prize. Are you ready for face two? Yes. See that Bro, Mr. Beast is cool as hell. Like he just be doing some two. crazy that shit. He's going to lift your car up 100 feet and then in 24 hours drop it and you have to catch it without it being destroyed. Seriously? Yeah. All right, bring it over. Yeah, here. how do you do that? Like, the world's first 100-foot Lamborghini freefall. There goes your Lamborghini. TTV tonight. What's good with you, bro? I'm going to be back next stream. I heard you. I'm going to be watching for you, smart. I'm going to be watching for you. Bro, Mr. Beast is crazy, bro. What's good, Keaton? You need to come run the crane and forklift for real? Need me to come around that? Hey, that, like, this shit is crazy, bro. Mr. Beast be just, like, buying shit to tear up, bro. Like, bro, I'm just so confused on this video. I'm like, what the hell? Like, literally, what the hell? day one with flying colors the bad news is uh, the Lamborghini is airborne okay so anyone got any idea I mean uh, yeah I mean like what do we think the bouncy castles bouncy castles that, that's actually not that bad bouncy castles that's not bad at all really and after being yeah what the hell I wouldn't even know what to do I'll put a trampoline on that bitch or something I would like to move the connexes in like a square like a trampoline like Way I can just fill the square up with a bunch of air mattresses. Yeah. Grab, and I'll top it all off with a bunch Smart. of Smart. Just, you know, the biggest problem right Ooh. now is I have no material. Everything that I bought is hard concrete or metal. And nothing that I bought I can use for day two. So I have absolutely nothing. And so Blake sent his crew to buy every pillow and air mattress in the city. And even though he was incredibly sleep deprived, he got to work. I'm already at the stage where... This video is actually kind of crazy. Again? Oh yeah, that's right. I'm in a challenge for a Lamborghini. Fuck. Floating in the sky right now. By the time his materials had arrived, Blake had been awake for over 24 hours and was in desperate need of sleep. I'm gonna try to get some sleep because I'm exhausted and it's four in the morning. And with how exhausted Blake was, he ended up sleeping for way longer than he planned. Oh. Blake! Um, is he serious? What is this? He got mattresses, pillows, and blankets, but he's missing the warm milk. Yeah, that's the key to everything. Where is Blake? He's asleep, I heard. No, he's not. Yeah. By the time Blake got on site, he was already super late in the day. That's Blake's truck pulling up. Right, we need to get to work, come on. All right, let's just see what this looks like. Oh, that bouncy house works as a big box. So I'm thinking maybe we put that thing in the middle now and then we start blowing it up. Only four and a half hours remain and it's not looking good for Blake. I don't think he has more than Yeah, that Lambo is destroyed. And even if he does, there's no I'm sorry, brother man. Start filling up the side so that way it's high over here takes away this wall so with only a couple of hours remaining blake did all that he could by filling the rest of his pit with cardboard boxes and bubble wrap coming down to the cardboard line. box Taylor, how much time is left one hour blake is screwed i have a little bit of bubble wrap left i think i'm just gonna get raised on this thing and just wrap my baby up in this bubble wrap and i'm good to go that's definitely gonna help blake spent what little time he had remaining on this crane failing at trying to bubble wrap his car it's just not gonna work you know what time it is what time to drop the car Let's drop this bad boy. Oh shit, bro. He barely got the I'll bubble wrap. Like, do you think your Lamborghini will survive? I'm positive, dude. He's more certain than me. <laughs> I'm positive about this one. I bought every air mattress at Walmart. If this won't catch it, I don't know what will. I did everything I can. Here's a Feastables bar, Blake. Oh, Are those Feastables bars even ball. good? <laughs> I never have uh, sure tried one. Oh um, yeah. I'm curious what you think. But anyways, you have three bouncy castles, 150 mattresses. How many pillows? 150. 150 pillows and 2,000 cardboard boxes. Will it break the Lamborghini's fall? Yes. Yes. That's two yeses. Okay. I'm scared for that Lambo. This, no pun intended. Three, two, one. Drop the Lamborghini. Oh shit, that bitch probably busted it. Yeah, that did not. Get these boxes out of the way. Oh. 
front. We're about to find out how damaged this car is. The lights work. Ooh. The lights work? Yeah, this princess castle might have saved this entire car. Moment well, of truth. You might have been the first person in history to catch a Lamborghini. If it turns on. All right, here we go, here we go, here we go. That bitch still sounds crazy. <laughs> Everything looks good, minus a little crack in the bumper. Which Damn. we found out by this official appraiser. This was only going to reduce the price of Blake's Lamborghini by probably 10 grand. Hold Thank on. you so much. Thanks for the good news. 10 now grand is crazy. 10 grand for a bumper? Oh my god. Flaming car. For Blake's next challenge, we're bringing back his biggest nightmare. We have recreated the flaming cars challenge that cost Blake everything last time. Wow, that's a low blow. But seeing how he's done this before, we're gonna up the stakes by dropping twice as many cars as last time. Wait, what, what the fuck did they do last time? Redemption day. Blake spent the rest of the night disassembling his defense for phase two. And after a good night of sleep, he was ready to begin his defense for phase three. It's in the morning, just woke up. We got a lot of work. This is a big ass construction site, bro. This dude, Mr. Beast has. This is crazy. And I'm going to drop it right on the car. Next, I'm going to take two more containers and I'm going to lean them up, coming to a point right above the car. And most importantly, nothing flammable this time. Do you think that was a Car? Yes, sir. Oh, I thought you were gonna say no. <laughs> Blake then asked his crew to remove every piece of wood that was in the container because that's what ended his challenge last time. He then had them cut out the bottom of the container that would surround the Lamborghini. The storage container could put a lot of damage. Completely crush it? Yeah. It can? I mean, yeah, I think it weighs a whole lot. And with that being done, Blake just needs to lower the container carefully over the Lamborghini without damaging. One scratch could cost him thousands of dollars. You're good, just like that. It is so close to scraping the car. Watch your fingers, we're coming down. Yes! I yes! cannot believe that. All right, next we're gonna bring these containers together. This challenge is actually what crazy as hell. Yeah, that's, that can't happen, dude. That's this is no cap this crazy. Like, what the, the hell? How does Mr. Beast even think of these kind of things? Deflector car. 100%. 20 minutes remain, and then we see if that Lamborghini perishes just like his 500 grand. And as usual, Blake utilized every last second. Three, two, one. Not quite sure what that dirt accomplished. <coughs> time is up. No. Let's see if, unlike last time, you survive phase three. Redemption. Blake. You lost $500,000 from this exact challenge. How are you feeling? I feel pretty confident. I think the viewers want to know one thing. Did you put wood inside of there like last time? A little bit. No, I'm just kidding. There's no wood in there. It was one of the biggest mistakes I've ever made in my life. Moment <laughs> of truth. Come on in. Three Dog, this is crazy. Like, what? Mr. Beast is insane for like this. Pointed roof thing versus 10 flaming cars. Are you ready? 10 That's flaming cool. cars. Fight it on fire. We'll Damn! Be one step closer to going home with a brand new Lamborghini filled with one hundred thousand dollars. Hundred thousand dollars is crazy. And go home with nothing. We're about to find out. Three, two, one. Drop it! Oh! 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 You did not. I want feel that. like that's exactly what he didn't want to happen. Oh no. Still feeling good? Not as good. Yeah, this is giving me some flashbacks. It's giving you some flashbacks. All right, ready for the next one? Just do it, just do it. Drop it. Oh my God, the roof looks like it's already buckling. And just in case Blake loses to the flaming cars like last time, I'm gonna take this moment and tell you about this amazing new phone. What you're currently watching on is the new Samsung Galaxy S24 Ultra. This and bro is promoting so much, bro. That's day. crazy. We're like 200 feet away, and it's nighttime. And look at how crystal clear it is. <laughs> and go ahead and drop it. Oh, oh, that hurt to watch. It also has a ton of new features with Galaxy AI, like photo assist. Remember the last challenge when the bumper got cracked on the Lambo? This is hurting me to watch. Like this, and then all you do is you hit that eraser button. And just like that, the bumper is fixed. I have a new car. For the picture you do. Whenever you're ready. 
This phone also has circle to search with Google, which makes finding information incredibly easy. It would have helped Blake a lot in the last video. Dog like about the flammability of wood and railroad ties. The, the, the crazy the railroad ties and ask is this flammable? As you can see, railroad ties are flammable. He would have learned the answer. Bro. I just told you. Mr. Beast is an amazing YouTuber, dude. His videos are genuinely impressed by this phone, and I think you will be too. Crazy. And he has so much sponsors. So many sponsors. We drop car after car, and with each one, we could tell Blake was getting nervous. But we also noticed that all of the impacts were starting to damage the crate itself. Your crate on the bottom is Boeing. At this point, the container protecting the Lamborghini was being crushed by the weight and heat of the cars. I thought about this every day since the last time I saw this. And now it's time for the final car! Yeah, he needs to get that car up out of there. Yes. Fall. Uh, fall. Oh, oh, no. Bro, it's got to be a thousand degrees in there. His car has to be melting now. We got the fire extinguisher. Yeah, that money is burnt up. Be careful, Mike. That money is burnt up. How that is money it? is gone. It's okay. It's okay. Yes! You like that? Bro, that if car is... Dropped, this crate would have collapsed. You stopped 10,000 bullets. Easy. You caught a car out of midair. You now deflated... Yeah, this challenge is crazy as hell. And now it's time for phase four. Bring on the train. This has got to be the last challenge. This is crazy. What the hell? Dog, bro. Mr. Beast the W for this video. This literally has me entertained. What is he even running at? Blake knew that the train was going to be the most deadly attack yet. So he wasted no time in getting started. I think the best way to stop a train is to derail it. That's what I've tried to build here. All these railroad ties are tucked snug, and all of these are gonna go under the train, the train's gonna hit them like that. And if I do that a hundred more times, I don't see the train just blowing past all that. The railroad ties lost me the challenge last video. This time, they'll save me. You just need two inches off the track, and I win. Two inches is a lot, though. My oh, man. And then once I have all this done, I can just put concrete on top. I think that's gonna work, man. I think that's gonna work. Blake worked with his crew throughout the entire night. And when I showed up the next morning, it was obvious that the challenge had taken a toll on him. What's up, Jimbo? What happened to your voice? I'm like dying out here. As you guys know, he lost $250,000 in this video. He lost half a million dollars in this video. I think Blake- My nigga been losing. He has an army going super hard. They're currently stacking the cars that we dropped on phase three on the train tracks. But time was still ticking down. And in order to stop this train and take his Lambo home, Blake began adding a lot more objects to the tracks, like shipping containers, mattresses to cushion the impact, Blake's worked so hard. I'm now on his team. And water tanks. Blake really seems to know what he's doing. Too bad there's only 11 minutes left. At this point, Blake did everything he could to finish his build before time ran out. And it was actually starting to look impressive. This is it. Three. Final stretch. Two. One. Last line of defense. Time's up. Stop. Turn it off. Turn it off. Time is officially up. Oh, my God. From phase Damn, one. Damn, it's the last phase, challenge. Phase two, this is crazy. Phases, and even phase three's burning cars, you somehow use all the resources from the previous phases. Let's see if you're driving home in a Lamborghini or if I'm dropping you off at your house. Or I'm dropping you off at your house is crazy. Everything. We need to back the train up. We're gonna go really far back. That way the train can pick up a lot of speed before it hits everything. Sound like a good idea? No. Are you gonna stand on the train? Do you think your Lamborghini will survive? God, I hope so. That sounds like a badass idea. The new formula is the best chocolate on This nigga Mr. Beast bought a train for this video too. Bro, what kind of money does Mr. Beast actually have? I'm pocket watching. That nigga got crazy money. You bought a train for a video? Do yourself a favor and go give it a try. But for now, it's time for the biggest moment of Blake's life. Let's see if he wins a Lamborghini. Blake, any last words? Give it all you got. Send the train. Here it comes. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. It's coming! It's gonna speed up until it hits 35 miles an hour right before impact. Dude, it is going quick. It's just gonna derail, it's just gonna derail. Here she comes! Let's see if it was all worth it. Shit. 
Damn, that bitch is breaking through shit. Oh my god. Ah. Uh. Oh my god. I think he's gonna stop. He derailed it. Buddy going out in a Lambo. Oh my god. This is your new Lamborghini, Blake. Not only did he win the Lamborghini, that shit's sick. That's a W ass video. Mr. Beast is, bro, he's a, bro, Mr. Beast is a dope. Mr. Beast is crazy, bro. W, W, Mr. Beast. Holy shit.